Welcome back, we're here at New London Hospital, and joining me now is Special Events Coordinator, Sarah Humphreys, and New London Hospital Days is one week away. Yay! <laughs> we know it's summer if it's hospital days. Exactly, yes. <laughs> Super! So, tell us a little bit about some of the new events. You've got so many new ones this year. We do, we're really fortunate. So, the King Arthur Flower Bake Truck is gonna be with us Friday and Saturday night, and they're gonna be giving out cookies in exchange. They will be accepting donations that will be donated back to the hospital. Oh, that's wonderful. Yeah. Oh, their cookies are so good, yeah, too. <laughs> <laughs> so, that will be both Friday and Saturday. Mm -hmm. And then Friday night, the Lake Centipede Chamber Region of Commerce is doing their band night with Club Soda, mm -hmm. and the New London Rec Department is gonna be hosting a s'mores party as well out on the green. So, that's all Friday night? Yes. Okay. And then on Saturday, um, in addition to New Hampshire kittens coming back, we also have Wags and Wiggles, which is a local <laughs> dog uh, rescue organization. Okay. So we have both kittens and puppies out on the green. Oh, that's great. Yeah. yeah. And they'll be available for adoption? You won't be able to adopt them the day of, but you'll be able to meet the animals, fill out an application, and get okay. to answer, answer any questions you have. Perfect. Okay. That's Saturday. Uh -huh. Yes. And you've got the big market on the green that day. Is that yes. right? We have the Community Crafters show. Absolutely. The, there are some amazing artists there. Great place to pick up gifts, start your Christmas shopping early. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I've done that many years in the past. Mm -hmm. Great. And then there's usually a big is there breakfast and lunch. Yes. Always on yep. Saturday. <laughs> yes. So it's pancakes in the morning. Is that big, right? Yep. Big pancake breakfast in the morning mm -hmm. and uh, lunch in the afternoon. Okay, and that's why the Lions Club, I feel like, and the Rotary both bring us that. Yes, uh, Lions Club does the barbecue supper Friday night, and then Rotary does food for us on Saturday. Okay, super. Oh, that's always terrific, too. Yeah. Okay, good. What else on Saturday? Is that the stretcher race? Friday night's the stretcher race. Okay, so tell we, us a little bit about what that is. <laughs> so we're bringing that back. It'll be uh, the second annual, and it's featured um, the New London Fire Department, police department and then the hospital's EMS crew. Okay. So it starts in front of Alley Oops and they're gonna uh, run down Main Street to the inn. With a stretcher? With a stretcher. Is someone on the stretcher? No. Okay. I don't think so. <laughs> I volunteer <laughs> to do that. Lady. Okay. Yeah. So they have to run with that stretcher. stretcher. Yep. And we have a finish line and a great little prize for the winner. And bragging rights race. for a exactly. year. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Good. Tell us a little bit more about um, some of the old favorites, the Midway. That will yes. be back? so the Midway will be back um, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, and there'll be bracelet night as well. Mm -hmm. And that allows you to get on all the rides for just one price? Yes. Okay, that's fun. The teenagers like that night. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great. And then we will also have the teddy bear clinic. Oh, so cute. So kids can come get a teddy bear and have it uh, dressed and uh, looked at by our, our wonderful nursing staff. Oh, fun. And let's not forget the parade because we broadcast the parade right here on this station every year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that starts at two o'clock and it will come down Main Street. So we have really great um, new parade chairs this year who are just doing an awesome job incorporating the 100th anniversary of the hospital into the parade. So it's going to be awesome. Absolutely. Now, is it too late to get a float? No, if you okay. would still have an entry, um, we'll definitely find room for you and it doesn't have to be a flatbed if you just have hey. a group of people who want to walk, sure. um, hand out some candy, you know, ride your bike down the street, well, more the merrier. It's the 100th anniversary, gotta exactly. get in the parade, <laughs> yeah. And then finally on Sunday is the triathlon, one of the best area small triathlons, I love it. Oh, thank you. So yeah, this is our 35th annual mm -hmm. and according to our unofficial, unofficially uh, it is one of the longest running triathlons in New England. I believe it. And mm -hmm. it's what our, our time and company told us so we go with that and it starts at Buckland Beach at Little Lake Sunapee mm -hmm. and we're expecting over 200 athletes mm -hmm. so uh, we still are accepting registrations if you want to compete as an individual or a team okay. um, and we're also if you just want to come out and cheer. Fun. Love to have you too. And you can show up the day of the triathlon and just register that morning. Yes. Wonderful. Yep. Good. Well, it's something we all look forward to all year round here. It's hospital days and it's coming right up. You've got a great um, lineup of events right online. Yes, so if do. you wanted to see the days and the exact times, it's right on your website. Um, so thanks so much for coordinating that for us. Best wishes. Oh, thank you so much. Take care.